Hello, everybody. Becky Cohen, One Star Platinum. We are going to figure out how to add Branch Up to our Facebook business page. Okay, so we have Kenzie is here and she's going to put it on her business page. So obviously, we've gone to branchup.com. You guys, very simple. And it's going to pop right up. This is for travel agents and specifically for your Facebook business page. So she's going to go ahead and sign up for free, right? Because it is free. Mm -hmm. Going to follow all the prompts, you guys. You're going to put in your first, your last name. You're going to put in whatever email that you want information going to, which may be your business email that you created for your travel. Awesome. And create your own password. And of course, yes, you do always want to click little boxes receiving marketing e information. I know they did it one time. So go ahead and click that box. Oh, yeah. Unclick that box, right? It says I do not want to receive it. Good job. <laughs> Yay. I always save my passwords, but yep. <laughs> and then we're going to hit continue. And it's really simple, you guys. So it asks us some questions. What best describes you and your agency? Let's see what's in our drop down. And we are a home based agent. Mm -hmm. And seller of travel insurance is going to see, let's see. Um, we have a CST number. We also have a Washington number. I'm going to put, um, we're going to, doesn't say an IATA number. So let's put the seller of travel license. Let's try not required. Let's see what happens with that. Let's hit the not required one. Okay, United States. Yep, that's the one we want because we want the consortia because we're gonna go down now where it says, which consortia are you affiliated with? That's the one that we need to pick, you guys. And we are affiliated with, um, where is it, other? Travel Leaders Network. There it is. We have to go past other. Travel Leaders Network, you guys, is our consortia or consortium. That is the one that you guys are going to hit. Uh, do you make bookings through a host agency or franchise? Um, I think yes, right? That's our yes answer. Host agency that you work with. And there it is, Archer Travel Group. And deal. You guys, you don't have to put a website in here if you don't want, or you can put in your Evo website, ad agency website, for example. This helps customers contact you directly. That's totally up to you. I don't think it, it has to be done, but let's see. All right. Do you want to put yours in, Kenzie? Yeah. Um, yeah. Okay. okay. So we're just going to go into our back office. We're going to go to our travel site. She's going to grab, yep, there it is. That's it right there in the browser. She's going to copy that right out of there. And now she's going to go back to branch up and we're going to pop that in there. Yay. And if you wanted to upload your logo, you could, if you guys have one, you can always come back and do that as well. Awesome agency this is your agency so we can verify your agency you guys should all have that downloaded from the wherever the quick start documents in the back office it is archer travel services archer travel and it is whatever it is 29 something something um Foothill, Foothill Boulevard, 29. I want to say it's 2941, but I could be wrong. 
She's got it. She's got her document, which you guys should all have. Look at her folders, all nice and neat. <laughs> like organization. Um, yeah, I don't have that at all. There it is. Info for vendors. That's got to be it. She's an organizer. I don't know how to make folders for all of my, for my downloads is what I need. <laughs> there it is. And there it is. So I was right. 2941 Foothill Boulevard, La Crescenta. Mm -hmm. that's not archer information you guys should all have that copy of that page um, because that is the one that you're going to need for uh oh did we miss it oh it's create your profile it's right there. Yeah. there it is there it is <laughs> try to fool us <clears throat> I think it was in there it highlighted there it is there yeah is. yeah absolutely their phone number i can tell you that i know what that one is state is california sorry <laughs> and it is our 818-248-1511 and that's the archer office main office you guys so again, let's see this phone number. You book with suppliers, agency phone number. So we show your phone number. So this is your phone number now. So the next one is for your own phone number because it is going to be on your landing page. See where it says that? So pop in your phone number there, Kenzie, mm -hmm. in the second one. Mm -hmm. language preferred all right what is your estimated and you guys are obviously just going to pick the least amount this is an asterisk one so of course yeah we're going to pick that um ID number you typically use, you're going to open that drop down. And it is going to be that one. Yes, the IATA. And then the number. Mm -hmm. Perfect. See that you guys, she knows how to split her screen as well. Um, and now you guys get to just choose. So whatever it is that you want to, if you have a niche, if you don't, if you, you know, what, where are you wanting to sell to? So start picking some of those here. And that's what's going to start populating on your page. Okay, what type of travel? So again, her first choice was the Caribbean. What kind of travel? It's all going to be different. Mm -hmm. Perfect. You guys see that there's several choices to choose from. We've sent a confirmation. Now she's got to go to her email to complete her sign up. Yay. And now you guys can see she went and verified, right? And now she gets to join. She gets to join her Facebook. So we're going to click join, sign up for free. Mm -hmm. OK, 
continue is Kinsey on her Facebook. See, it's going to show her. You put it under your personal? For now, you're going to be able to choose it once we get okay. to that. Yeah. It'll ask you where, where you want it to go. It should ask us. Okay. This social account has been connected. Branch up is not connected to your business page. So now you come down to the green. Yep. Okay. Now you guys can see that she's on her Facebook page. She's, her picture is up here in top right. Um, and now she's going to go ahead, continue as Kenzie and where she wants it to go. Yep. She wants it to go to her business. Yay. And that's all done. See how simple that is. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yay. Cool. Easy. Yep. <laughs> Easy as that. See, uh, it should you hit okay. And it's going to pop us back out. Um, it's going to show us, right? Things to know. Here's how you can like learn about branch up. If you wanted to see what was going through, there is a little tutorial. Uh, it's going to show us all of our postings then behind there. What's going to be happening May 16th. You guys can see, you can scroll your page. Uh, she picked cruises and stuff like that. So this is awesome. These are um, pages uh, that are going to automatically post now on Kinsey's Facebook business page. And she's also going to have the option when she gets her LinkedIn up and running to have it connected as well. So this is what branch up is. And this is automated. You guys can come in here. You can add in postings if you want. You can delete something. Um, you can schedule more to go out or different times. If you did your little drop down the three dots there and that traveled that first one. Nope. Down. Oh. Well, yeah, <laughs> no. Down over inside the oh, here. Yeah, right there. Let's see what it says. So see how we can edit that. We can reschedule it. To, we could post it right now if you wanted to. Or if you don't like that post, you can delete it. So if you went ahead and posted that now, because it's not supposed to go out until tomorrow, let's go ahead and post that now. I want to see. And then let's go to your, let's go to your um, Facebook business page so that you guys can get an idea of what it's going to actually look like and how that's going to look on Kenzie's Facebook. And then once you guys get these up and running, remember, to always grab the link so that we can go in and review them. <laughs> and Facebook does weird things now, so I don't like really care for it because you have to do the little switcheroo, right? <laughs> I don't know, it all, did all kinds of weird things here in the last year and a half. So. Um, now her page, we should have that. Yay. Check that out Thanks. now. Yep. Click into that picture. I want you guys all to see once she like comes into this, um, this is what branch up does for you. If somebody comes now onto your Facebook business page, they click into this. Look at that. Um, on, oh, wow. fortunately it says Archer Travel Services. We could probably go in there and edit that. In seven beautiful countries mm -hmm. on a part wow. of Europe to earn these discounted trips. Check that okay. out. It was a video as well. But you guys see that? This is her phone number. It's got her request. Um, it's got a majority of her information. We should be able to go in and, and edit out Archer Travel Services right there um, out of I don't know why that's in there in our uh, branch up. Yeah, let's go back and see if we can't change that. So that's up in your three lines on the left, wasn't it? Um, Facebook or connection, or it's got to be in our supplier profile, not supplier profile. Hmm, maybe it's in our. Yeah, in your KV over here on the right, in our settings, right? Our personal details and our agency details is going to be in one of those. 
our agency details, we know it says host agencies, Archer Travel. So let's go into your personal then. Mm -hmm. email address phone number huh i wonder if mine i would have to go and look at mine to see if it has um maybe under here profile info oh, well it's, no. yeah it's right there up there see where it says archer travel mm -hmm. service too yeah is there a gear? Can you do the gear by profile info? It just closes it. Oh, okay. Because I know we had to like put it in there, but we shouldn't have to have it in there. Um, they verified our account now. So where was it listed at? At our agency details? Is that where Archer is yes. listed at? Yeah, under the travel leaders and then it's Archer Travel Group. Huh, okay. But it doesn't have an asterisk, so maybe. Oh, have... yeah, you're right. Exit out of there. Okay, now let's save our changes. See if we have to, it doesn't ask us to save our changes. Yeah, let's see. Okay, so there you guys go. So if we can get away with not having that on there, now let's open up your, yeah. No, nope, mm -hmm. still there. I wonder if we need to do, like put up a new one. <laughs> oh, like the post. Yeah. Post a new one now that we've changed it. I'm going to go back to our home page on here. Hmm. Now let's see. <clears throat> Let's post one. We're just checking this out to see. I'm going to have to go in and look at mine as well to see if mine says Archer Travel. So with the uh, Facebook business, if it branches up there, does it also show up on your personal Facebook page? No, no, nope. This one doesn't have, this one just says, um, it doesn't have that because it's not a click in link. You know what I'm saying, Kinsey? Yeah. Yeah. So we'll just have to watch that. We're going to have to like do some digging on that one, you guys, but great. Yay. Thank you, Kinsey, for allowing us to do a new branch up video. Hope this was helpful for everybody. We did learn a lot uh, on this one. So thank you very much. You guys remember to always post the link to whatever new so that we can come in and leave reviews. Okay. So again, Becky Cohen, your one-star platinum leader and trainer.